first started racing motorcycles and learning how to service them, I was told by the mechanics at my shop I would never be a true motorcyclist or mechanic until I had read Zen and the Art of Motorcycle Maintenance. In those days before the internet, I had to travel to several used bookstores until I found this old and well-worn copy. I then began to read this interesting and complex book. This is not just a story about motorcycles and servicing them, but the journey of a father and son trying to reconnect as they travel on one last motorcycle ride from Minnesota to California. At the same time, the father is dealing with his own issues from a previous mental breakdown. The story flashes back and forth between his troubled past, philosophies from various parts of the world, along with his current fractured relationship with his son. This is not an easy book to read. First published in 1974, the idea of melding Eastern and Western philosophies was new at that time. Robert Persing does spend a great deal of time discussing the concept of quality and how it can be defined. He also refers to ancient Greek philosophers and, of course, Zen, so you may find yourself visiting Google or other philosophy books to understand some of the passages. The general consensus seems to be that most readers would either love or hate this book. Many who love it feel it changed their life. Those that hate it generally don't finish it or skip over parts of the book. I'm in the middle ground who felt it was a good book worth the read and it helped understand a little bit more about us. Reading this book did not radically change my life, but it did make me a true motorcyclist and motorcycle mechanic. In the description of this video, I'll leave a link to where you may find this book.